uh, the soup potholes to downtown Vancouver, Georgia, and how. What is this place? Uh, this is the heart of Babylon. We're in the heart of the system in Babylon here. Can we do a little spin? Sure. The belly of the beast. Yep. Beautiful Vancouver, BC. Here we are. In that belly. Is the there beast. a message? In the belly of the beast? Is there a message in the belly of the beast? There is a way out of the belly, but uh, it takes everyone's cooperation and not cooperation, collaboration. Because you can't climb out of the belly by yourself. Go. You can't climb out of the belly by yourself. But there are there are there are ways out um, that we can co-create if we all believe we can co-create it. But there's no way getting out of the belly by yourself. And if you just keep doing it by yourself, you're gonna stay trapped right here in the belly. What, what, what about like if all these pieces are there together, uh, all, all the people are there together and like this, uh, we're all already here, what, and you're, we're waiting to, to hear you, like that last piece, what, what do we need to do together? Believe that it's even possible and put yourself on the line and just do it. Do what? create the new system well not a new system but create another world create another world that's another world. very far away from Babylon here that has nothing to do with Babylon to be sovereign human beings free what do we need to do what do we what do we need to do yeah. like me and you need to do or like what do like what does like humanity need to do yeah, like like we, we you said, like to, to get out of this place, we need uh, multiple people. Like we can't. We all need to enter an extraordinary space. Okay. Being willing to live in the unknown for a little bit in order for something great to come out of it, and just keeping that belief that it's there. What what's stopping us from being there? Fear. That maybe we'll have to actually do it all on our own. Here, straight up here. That if I go in, that if I go into this, and what if like everyone backs out, and then you start seeing people back out, and it's like you know, it's like a, it's like when like the military used to charge before there were like guns. You know, they had like spears, and they'd like charge the other army, like ah! But the one who was leading the army, or the people who were in the front leading the army. It like gave the soldiers in the back the courage to like continue to move forward. Yeah. The ones, yeah, the ones who were like charging in the front. Can we do that right now? Ah! Let's go. Let's go. <laughs> Running, we're gonna run over there. I'm gonna skateboard over there. Okay. Oh.